Here's a brief video tutorial for you demonstrating how to upload a video um, into Google so that you can uh, keep it and that you don't uh, run the risk of losing it or misplacing it um, um, in your files on your computer. Uh, now in subsequent videos we've talked about um, uh, downloading Zoom recordings uh, to clean up your, your cloud recordings and your account settings, but this really can be any video that you create, any video that you um, either create in a screencast, you can um, upload into a folder in Google. If there's a video that you download from YouTube that you want, you can upload the, that video uh, provided that you have the right uh, copyright permissions or the Creative Commons uh, permissions to do so. But any video that you create personally that um, uh, comes out of your own innovation and creativity, you can upload into uh, Google and then, of course, share the link and so forth. So I'm over in my drive. Uh, I've created a folder under um, a um, another folder in my drive, and I've called this Canvas It's Legit Video Recordings. And so uh, to do where, whatever folder you want to put it in, uh, you just simply click the new, then say folder, and then you create the name for the folder, uh, which is what I did right here. So I want to click on this folder, and now I'm going to upload one of the previous video recordings uh, that I just downloaded from Zoom. Okay, so I'm going to come over here to new. And I'm going to say file upload. Now, uh, depending on the size of the di uh, of the file itself, that in itself could take a while to uh, to upload. So just keep that in mind. So, um, so I'm going to go to my downloads now. I've organized my downloads by kind so that all my folders appear at the top. But I want to come down here to to the movies, which is right here. You can see uh, movies, which is where all my, all my MP4s come because I organized by kind. Now, you could very well decide that you want to organize it some other way by name, date added, which puts everything at the top, and so forth. Okay, however you want to organize that. But I found my uh, my fold, my uh, files here. Now, if I try to upload multiple, I just simply um, click on one, do the shift and the arrow down. I can highlight as many as I want. Now, the more you want to upload, if they're small files, you can just upload them all, all at once. But these are pretty big, so I'm going to uh, simply uh, click on this first one, and I'm going to say open. And um, what it's going to do is it's going to show the, the minutes in which it is left. Um, it's going to show you the status bar. You can see they're working. Um, and so... Uh, I'm going to I'm going to pause the video for just a minute, just so that we can give it time to um, upload. Okay, um, you can see now that the uh, video has uploaded here. So now I can click on this video, um, and it's going to take some time to render. Okay, so it says that we're processing this video. Check back later, or download the video now. Okay, well, you've already downloaded it, so you don't need to download it again. But just give it time, and it's going to, um, uh, it, depending on the size, um, it will render, and then you'll see a, the, the image of the video, and you can hit play from here. But you'll also want to be able to, over here, under more actions, you'll need to be able to then set the share settings. Um, remember the share settings, whatever folder it is, in pl it is placed in inherits the share settings of that folder. So if you want to change it, if I want to put, I want to send this video outside of Iredell Statesville, I can simply click on the Iredell Statesville and say anyone with link can view. There is no editing ability when you upload videos. It's just viewing ability or commenting ability. Um, so I can do anyone in Iredell Statesville can view. I can make this restricted. Um, I can do anyone in Iredell Statesville, anyone with link can view and then just do done. Uh, and then I can grab... Um, the video link here, but just simply copy in the link, and then I can share that to um, to folks, to my students, to parents, to whomever it is that I want to send this to. Okay, hope that helps. Uh, let us know if you have any questions.